So guys, a lot of you have commented on my um, video that I made for Manny Pacquiao battering the, the sparring partners. And a lot of you have said, well, you know, if Keith Thurman's going to get that, Keith Thurman's going to get beat up. And I want to do a video about it. Listen, I've always said that I favoured Pacquiao in the fight. I've always said that I like Pacquiao. And I think Pacquiao, I, I think he's going to win, if I'm honest with you. Uh, I think he's going to get the job done. Uh, but I don't think we should read too much into sparring, you know. I think sparring can be very misleading. Um, I think it's it's obviously um, great to hear that Pacquiao is doing well in sparring. And he's, and he's you know, putting it on the sparring partners. Uh, but that's what he's supposed to do. You know, Manny Pacquiao is supposed to look good in sparring. He's supposed to be uh, performing well. He's supposed to be going in there and, and putting on a show against the sparring partners. Um, you know, you know that's the rumours that we hear from every top uh, train, or every training camp. When a, you know, a top fight is made and when a big fight is made, oh, they're running away from uh, the sparring partners are running away. The sparring partners are getting scared. They're getting hurt. You know, they, we can't find sparring partners. We've seen it with Canelo. We've seen it in the past with all with with you know every high level fight. You know, just to kind of get into the opponent's head. You know, we it's not something that we we're, we're seeing new here with the Pacquiao Thurman situation with Pacquiao battering sparring partners. And I'm not listen. I'm not doubting that Pacquiao is battering sparring partners. Listen, it's Manny Pacquiao. He's fighting guys that are sparring him are going to be nowhere near on his level. You know, when you spar with people, they're not going to be championship level fighters. They're going to be fighters of a lower caliber. Do you understand? So, you know, Pacquiao's not going to be sp sparring, you know, elite level world champions, you know, to prepare for Keith Them. And he's going to be sparring with guys that are, are much, you know, lower level. Um, so it, there's no surprise if he is battering them. Um, but I do think, I do think that, you know, sometimes these, these, you know, it can be, it can be made up a little bit. I don't think, I don't think it's as, uh, as accurate all the time as what they make it out to be. I think, like I said, sometimes it's just mind games and psychological warfare that's going on. And I think that's what's going on here with uh, Thurman Pacquiao. I think Pacquiao's just trying to get into Thurman's head. I think Thurman's been talking a lot of crap and Pacquiao's just trying to get into his head a little bit, just like Thurman was trying to get into Pacquiao's head. Uh, I don't think it's going to make a difference, if I'm honest with you, uh, in the fight. But you got to understand that just because Pacquiao's beating up sparring partner doesn't mean he's going to beat up Thurman. Even though I think Pacquiao's going to win the fight, don't be fooled to think that, you know, that's what's going to happen in the fight. We heard that with Canelo. Oh, Canelo, Mosley didn't want to spar him. All these guys were, get, were getting beaten up in sparring. When May, when he came up against Mayweather, we saw how that one went. So just because you're beating somebody up in sparring doesn't mean anything. It doesn't mean you're going to win the fight. It doesn't mean that you're going to beat up Keith Thurman. Because firstly, Keith Thurman is not the sparring partners. He's a lot better. Uh, he's an elite level world champion. You can't get elite level world champions to spar with you. Very unlikely. Uh, that you get top top sparring now usually it's hot prospects or young kids that are coming up that you know are trying to make a name so it's not wouldn't be a surprise if Pacquiao beats the, those guys up but in terms of when he gets in the ring with Keith Thurman he's fighting a whole different level guy and, and we probably you probably heard the, it, uh, the saying before that sparring's not fighting even though it is fighting because you are technically in a in a boxing ring with bigger gloves of course and you are you are you know ex you're throwing leather at each other so you are fighting but it's not it's not you know it's it's not like the actual fight and you've got to we've got to understand that you know it's not the actual fight uh the actual fight is 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 them in a ring with you know 10 ounce gloves uh landing blows on one another um so you know that's that that, that that's what it is um, so I don't think we should read too much into sparring. Um, you know, I, I think I think people like to read too much into sparring stories and what's going on in sparring. I don't think when a lot of the times, you know, it doesn't really mean anything on the night. And I, and I do think that in this situation, I think it might not mean anything. Uh, you know, um, I think Thurman's going to be tricky, but I just think Pacquiao's going to get him. I, listen, if Thurman can box a good fight for 12 rounds, Thurman might win. But I just don't think he can. That's why I think he's going to lose. I think he's going to get caught somewhere down, down the line. And I think Pacquiao will finish him. Um, that's just my taking on it. But I don't think by reading into sparring stories, we should start making our conclusions of what's going to happen. Because like I said, firstly, sparring stories can be crap. And even if Pacquiao is beating up sparring partners, 
the sparring partners aren't on Keith Thurman's level. They're not elite level world champions. So I just want to make a video about that. Uh, but leave your thoughts, guys. Let me know what you think. And guys, remember to please like, share and subscribe to my channel. I'll see you guys in the next video.